database programming student database example namespaces used are given system.data.ledb the system.data.ledb namespace is the .net framework data provider for ledb it describes a collection of classes used to access an ledb data source in the managed space Select New from File menu and select Project. Select Visual C Sharp. Select Windows Forms application. Type your project name. Select the location and create the project. Give a meaningful name to the form. Design your dialog box or the graphical interface using the toolbox and the resource editor. Drag and drop the menu strip to the form. Type and add the menu items. Double click on the menu item to create the click event. Drag and drop data grid view into the form. Go to the properties and give a meaningful name to the data grid view. Double click on the form to generate the load function of the form. Copying the required code to set the column names of the data table. Type or paste the code to set the column names of the data table. An object of data table must be created. Copying the code to create the object of data table. Type or paste the code to create the object of data table. Execute the project. Data grid is created. Now we will see how to create a database connection. The namespace LEDB is used for data manipulation. Create an object of LEDB connection. Copying the code to create database connection.
Type or paste the code to create database connection. This is the connection string of student database. First, create a MS Access file student database with table student underscore tb. For saving the time, an existing database is copied here. This is the database. From the properties, copy the location and update the address in the connection string as shown. Execute the project. Copying the required code to show all student details. Type or paste the code to show all student details. Add some data in the database. A LEDB command class represents an SQL statement or stored procedure to execute against a data source. A LEDB data adapter class represents a set of data commands and a database connection that are used to fill the data set and update the data source. The dataset is a memory resident representation of data which represents a complete set of data including related tables, constraints and relationships among the tables. Execute the program. All student details are displayed. Now add a Windows form to add student details. Design your dialog box or the graphical interface using the toolbox and the resource editor. Create and name the controls.
Double click on close button to generate button click method. This dot close method closes the form. Now, create a database connection. Copying the required code to set database connection. Type or paste the code to set database connection. Copying the code to load form to add student in the menu click. Type or paste this code in the menu click method. Double click on the button to create command handler. Copying the required code to add student details. Type or paste the code to add student details. This is the query to insert a student record into the database. Now, execute the project. Add a new student record. Now, select the menu to show all student details. List of all students is displayed. You can see the newly added student's details. Now, add a Windows form to delete student details. Design your dialog box or the graphical interface using the toolbox and the resource editor. Create and name the controls.
Double click on the button to create command handler. Create database connection. Double click on the form to generate the load function of the form. Copying the required code to load student information. Type or paste the code to load student information. Call this function in the form load. Copying the code to load form to delete student in the menu click. Type or paste this code in the menu click method. Go to the properties of the list box. From the functions, add function selected index changed. Copying the required code to load student details according to the selection change in the list box. Type or paste the code here. This is the query to read the student details of the selected student ID. OLEDB Data Reader object provides a connection-oriented data access to the OLEDB data sources. Execute reader method in the OLEDB command object sends the commands to OLEDB connection object. Label name in the form is updated with the name of the selected student. Copying the required code to delete the selected student's details. Type or paste the code here. This is the query to delete the selected student's record from the database. Here, data reader is executed. This renews the list of students in the list box. This dot close method closes the form. Execute and verify the result.